$9.99. Choose the 50 foot, the 75 foot, or the 100 foot. Lou Caputo! Hello, Shannon. What are you doing? Well, I'm just showing you how with the bionic hose, you can have all these knots in it, but you can't kink it, you can't cut it, and you can't crush it. So that water's just gonna keep flowing no matter what you got going on. Isn't that's that great? nice. Yeah, that's a power of stainless steel right there. Okay, now I bought, now th this is a true story. I saw you on the air with this. Yes. Uh, because I, like many of Americans watching this show, have the hose of shame. Oh no. Or, you know, so I tried the lightweight ones mm -hmm. and you know what? They didn't stand up, right? No, they then never you do. tried the typical, you know, the green the green guy. The green guy. The green guy. Yeah. Not, not cutting good. it. Not good. Not cutting it. Is this my forever hose? This is your forever hose. It's this my is the one. Hose. Once you get this home, you're going to be like, how did I ever go without this yeah. hose? Well, let me show you the most basic thing about this, okay? If you take a common rubber hose, you can just twist it like that and pinch it yeah. and stop the flow of water. Oh, yeah. If I take my 304 stainless steel bionic hose, hold it here in my hand and watch this. Yeah. I am squeezing that with all the force in my hand. I cannot kink that enough nope. to stop the flow of the water through this. Nope. And that's just one of the aspects yeah, of this. It is. So what has been the most popular size? I'm kind of curious. The 100 foot. Oh, is it the one, really? Well, here's the thing. Okay. A lot of people are buying longer lengths of hose yeah. because with the Bionic hose, it takes up a lot less space and it weighs less. So you can have a longer hose now. Right. Okay. Do you, is that a perfect, do you want to? Well, since you mentioned it. Since, <laughs> since you asked. Since you asked. <laughs> now, right here, we've got two 100 foot hoses, okay? 100 feet of rubber hose, 100 feet of Bionic hose, yep. okay? Yep. The 100 feet of rubber hose weighs in at about 15 pounds. The 100 feet of the Bionic hose in the stainless steel yeah. is only eight pounds. See, now I would Seven not expect that. Difference. That, that right? actually surprised me. Because I thought, oh gosh, it's pretty. I mean, yeah. I know you're not buying it because it's pretty, but some people do Some though. people do. It looks nice. Yeah, it looks nice, But right? it's counterintuitive. You wouldn't yeah. expect that to be the case. Well, here's the thing. If I take a rubber hose, and you know, I'm not gentle, and nobody is when they're out working in their yards, oh, right? Oh, Lord. Take yeah. the saw, right? Oh, and watch this. No, no, I'm going to no, no, saw, no. and you can see the chunks of rubber flying oh, off of here. Well, in seconds, no. look what we've done. <gasps> okay, oh, we've ruined that hose but if I slide on over oh. the bionic hose right here yeah. and then I take that same saw oh goodness gracious yeah but me. you know here's the crazy and you can hear it you can hear yes, that blade going back and forth look at that not okay, a that mark on there wild. and that's why we say it's your forever hose because you can wild. drag it all over your property you, you can't all right you know what you, you know I'm from Minnesota and there's not yes. much cold weather right now hmm. fine in the four hour a day heat but what say you Take a look at this. Caputo well here you go here we froze one of the bionic hoses in, a froze block, it? in a block of ice <gasps> right there and what that's showing you is that you know like a typical rubber hose if you have that out and you leave it out in the winter time it's going to burst because that water is going to freeze you it know. okay the yeah. bionic hose is rated to take up to 600 psi pounds per square inch of pressure yeah. okay um, your house puts out 60 by comparison okay so oh, it's 10 oh, times stronger oh, okay. but when it comes to freezing those kind of temperatures it's not going to burst this hose so it's wow. going to last through the summer through the winter speaking of summer so here in Florida oh, we all man. know it gets a little warm <laughs> um, and so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to show you a neat little trick we're going to take a heat gun this is oh. not a blow dryer right I'm going to turn this bad boy on high power and I'm gonna place it right on top of the rubber hose oh and right on top word. of the bionic hose. Oh, and I'm really? gonna want you to see what happens here because okay. a lot of people think because it's steel, right. it's gonna get really, really hot. I'm holding it here in my hand. Yeah. I think I'm already seeing smoke come off of here. Yeah, ooh, wow, ooh. Look at that. Woo, see the rubber's that. burning? Ooh. The rubber is yeah. burning on here and you can see right yeah. there. Now look at the bionic hose though. Oh, there wow. is nothing wrong. There's just one little chunk of rubber that came off the other hose, but there's nothing wrong in it. And that's why you can use this and it's gonna last summer after yeah. summer, year after year after year. For sure, so remember, I think that's interesting that the 100 foot is yeah. the most popular. It is the most popular. But remember, in honor of you know, what we're doing up for Tuesdays and our birthday month, that means that FlexPay is expiring right. at the stroke of midnight. Over 51,000 spoken for since its introduction basically a year ago. All you do is you choose your size of choice. Now remember, that means on the uh, on the 50 foot, you are looking at around $44. On the 75 foot, you are looking at around $64. And on the 100 foot, you're looking at almost $84. So, you know, arguably pretty close to a half off sale. I mean, that's, you know, by by my math, that's that's pretty doggone close. I, I mean, I, I think it is, you know, yeah. then if you're shopping elsewhere. Yeah, no, exactly. Well, and you know, let me show you, you know, another uh, difference right here. And this is what we started off with is if you look at all the knots in there, I think there's a dozen 
in knots in the Viana Coves right here. And you can see that water's freely flowing, okay? Here's a rubber hose that has about three or four knots in it at the most. They're both uh, attached to the exact same spigot. Okay, do you see what's going on here? Nothing coming oh, out of this guy, just a little tiny yeah. trickle. The Bionico's plenty of water coming Isn't out of it. Isn't that Because you can't, well, there's nothing worse than dragging out 100 feet of hose, <laughs> you know what I mean? And then having to backtrack yeah. it to find that kink no in it. Uh, you know, and walk all the way across your yard. Now, I want to show you something else very cool about this. I'm going to walk over to these two hose reels we have back here. Because we were showing you how the Bionico's weighs less, but it also takes up less space, okay? So, if you look at the two hose reels I have right here, this one is 100 feet of a regular rubber hose. This one is 100 feet of Bionic hose. And you clearly, you can see, this one is a mess over here. It's hard to get on the reel. You know, it's a brand new one, so this is about as pliable as it's ever gonna get. But you can see, we wouldn't be able to fit anything else on here. I'm gonna take another 100 feet of Bionic hose and attach it to this one. But before I do, I want you to see something. Oh. Notice how it's like quicksilver yeah. on the asphalt, oh, that's okay? cool. And the reason it's like that is because there's no friction from the stainless steel, or, or certainly less friction from the stainless steel than what you get from the rubber hose. So now you can attach any length of Bionic hose to another length, so you don't need to worry about that, okay? Here we go. I'm going to start reeling this in. Now remember, this is the second hundred feet of hose I'm putting on here. And I want you to see how quickly... It comes in. If you ever tried to reel up a rubber hose, you know it's very heavy. It takes a long time. You're out of breath by the time you're done. Look at this. And done. Just like that, that's 200 feet of Bionic hose. Standing ovation of one, Lou. Thank you. You, you know what's so funny? <laughs> Versus 100 feet on this one. Now, Shannon, here's what, I'm okay. gonna blow your mind a little oh, more. Oh, let's see. Oh, yeah, you gotta go. Okay, show. Inside of this bucket, yep. one, or a flower pot, I should say, 100 feet of Bionic hose. Nice. So if your homeowner's association doesn't let you have a hose reel, you can put this out there. Honey, they don't like the fact that they can see shoe boxes in my dining room window. Right. I don't like my hose. <laughs> One of the reasons I got a bionic hose. That's actually the true story because I'm trying my utmost best to grow tomatoes this year. And so I'm actually... I, I found out what you use a hose for <laughs> in 2018. Watering things. It's, it's been a growth year for me, <laughs> I have to say, and I got I got in trouble for my hose. So I think it's a big deal that, the, the thing is sometimes a garden hose is a necessary evil. Sure. It's the item as part of your outdoor repertoire that we love to hate. Right. You know, that it's like, okay, it leaks, it's heavy, it's got kinks in it, then the water pressure dies, then it gets that little leak, and then right. you get the old duct tape The whole out. thing, but yeah. look at this. This will never happen with the Bionic nope. hose because this is what it is, is a standard hose of sorts on the inside with all those steel windings. And that's 304 stainless steel, so it's never going to corrode. Nice. It's always going to look great. If you leave it in your driveway in the sun, it doesn't get hot to the touch because it's actually reflecting the sun, and it's lightweight. So you're yeah. getting all the best benefits yeah. of the steel nice. with none of the drawbacks. In fact, I want to show you this just because that's 100 feet of Bionic hose in oh, a standard, yeah, standard I bucket. I actually going to guess that was 50. No, 100 oh, feet. No. Kidding. In a standard oh, wow. bucket. Well, see, uh, so years ago when I lived in an apartment, yeah. um, we had a car washing station. Oh, Basically, sure. you know what I mean? I know, I know. It's yeah. like a glorified spigot. Yep. That's all it is. Don't get excited. So, uh, you know, but they didn't give you a hose. So oh, my problem was, right. where am I keeping this hose I'm washing my car with? No, so right. now, if you, you live in an apartment, a condo, you have an RV or a boat, yeah. you can just carry your hose around in a bucket in the trunk of the car, Very below cool. decks on the boat, and you can have a longer hose. Yeah. You don't have to go for the 25. You don't. And you Get know, the 100. And I know it's not why you're buying it, but it looks good. Yeah. It looks good. It really does. It does. And beyond the fact that it looks good, it solves all the things that we love to hate about our typical garden hose. Yeah. I mean, every time you do that little real demo yes people or that or that exactly tie knots in it I, uh, so here's the thing that five pay flex pay is actually good until tomorrow or as long as supplies last the 100 foot is choose it at this point it is the most popular mm -hmm. it is a great gift and I, I know it sounds funny but if you know someone who either loves to go we've all got the yard and even if it's something as simple as you know spraying off the sidewalk spraying right. off you know the, the garage you doors. know mundane stuff but exactly, you gotta do it everyday thing gotta do right it. you gotta but, do it but you shouldn't have to buy a new hose every year no. 
Bionicos. Exactly. And with the Bionicos, you want, yeah. listen, I'm one of those people that, you know, when the expandable hoses came out, the fabric yeah. ones, I was all in. I right. was like, yeah, I had, I bought yes. like three or four of them. Yep. But Me they too. all tore, Me they too. burst, all these Me things too. happened because they couldn't Same handle thing. the elements. The Bionic hose is going to handle yeah. it. Did we mention the, the, um, the uh, nozzle that's coming with this? Oh, no, we didn't. I couldn't think of the word, the nozzle. Okay. <laughs> okay, so this is the nozzle right here that's going to come with this. And what's different about this nozzle, you're getting this for free, what's different for this is, unlike some nozzles where you've got to actually squeeze yeah. to make the water come out, all you're doing with this one is you're just rotating the end of it, okay, like a right. fireman's nozzle. Oh. You just rotate the end of it, and that's going to change the stream from a very wide stream to a very narrow jet. Now, yeah. the reason I like this is, I, you know, I've broken my hand a couple times, and after having oh. to stand there mm. and hold the nozzle, yeah. the old and the other nozzles, it, it gets old on the hand. I mean, yes. it, it gets tough after all, especially right. if you've got limited mobility or arthritis. Yeah, well, actually, I've got arthritis in my hand. Okay, then, so all you yeah. got to do is just open it up to whatever you want. You can just stand there for hours, and oh, the water's man. just going to keep coming. I mean, that makes a big, big difference. I mean, trust me, especially, you know, whether it's a lawn, you know, yeah. or landscaping, or just trying yep. to get the siding, or the garage doors, or the sidewalk, yeah. wash a car. Any of those things. Any of those things. Well, and right? here's the thing, too. You can hook this up to, somebody asked me this the other day, yeah. can you hook this up to things that normal hoses hook up to? The answer is yes. So, like, you know, a sprinkler, your pressure washer, yeah. anything like that that you can attach a hose to. You Smart. can attach other hoses to this, yeah. if for some re reason you ever want right. to. Okay. Also, notice, this is an improvement right here. We've added the comfort grip to the end, oh, yeah. so it's not going to slide out of your hands when it gets wet. Right. We've also reinforced the ends on this, so there's over 100 pounds of pulling force that these can withstand oh, on God. either end. Yeah, so if this is attached to a spigot on your house and you're yanking on it, yeah. you're not going to pull it out. No kidding. Very strong. All right, uh, five pay flex pay, uh, good as long as supplies last until tomorrow, so that means from less to $6, or under $6, up to right a scoosh under $10. So there's a reason that we've sold over 51,000 of them. Lou, I gotta tell you, mm -hmm. I'm impressed. It's nice, right? I'm impressed. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> so, so you're going to the great indoors before I am. Is I that, am. Is, is that how this works? I'm gonna go sit in the air conditioning for. <laughs> Sorry. Rub it in, why don't you? <laughs> okay. All right, I'll see you inside I'll in just a, a few, few moments. All right. Okay. Uh, if actually, here's a little sneak peek at what Lou's going to have coming up. And then we're also doing a special birthday promotion as well, up to $25 uh, uh, when you use your HSN uh, charge card, uh, when you open that account. All right, we are scooting along. <laughs> Lori Leland, how are you? Oh, by the way, here's Nighthawk. If you want to pre-order, uh, Lou is going to give you full details on that coming up just a little bit later in our show. In the meantime, now this is a good girlfriend. My gal Friday, Lori Leland is going to take one for the team. She's actually going to get <laughs> under our rain on demand bigotry and I I have to say Laura you know how mad people were I mean, they've been waiting for this to, to be you know to come back into inventory you know that right right so I have lost count of how many hundreds of thousands of the different incarnations of better brella that we have sold all right at the risk of saying that uh, we don't want this presentation to be all wet <laughs> Right? This is a way for you to not only protect yourself from the elements, rain, sleet, snow, sun, as well, but it ain't so big that I'll leave it behind right. at the gym, at the grocery store, in my trunk. Now, the ingenious engineers behind this have found a way to take all of those upgrades that umbrellas in the past have never had but make it in a much more compact design. Quite frankly, and you can make a case for anything, I like the engineering features on on, on, this on, one the, the, on the go side. Right, it's, right. it's so good. Well, here's the one I was just holding, and yeah. you can see all the waters on the inside. So this is that reverse open yep. and close technology. So everything that I'm touching, which is the inside, is all totally and completely dry. Yep. And this is that brand new hydro, uh, hydrophobic fabrication. So it's going to allow the water to roll right off. And here's what I think you're going to love about the Better Brella. So many things. Uh, one of them is the giant size. So 46 inches here, automatic open and close. So with one touch of a button, 
button, you're automatically closing that bed umbrella. And again, all the moisture's on the inside, so you're touching the dry parts of the umbrella. You can also get in and out of very small spaces very easily. And Shannon's right, the technology and the portability of this compact bed umbrella is the best yet, because look at how teeny tiny this is. You're gonna be able to bring this everywhere with you. And then when you need protection from the elements, whether it's sleet, sun, snow, you push that one touch button and you are instantly and immediately protected. This is also super durable. So we like to say it could be the last umbrella you ever need to buy because it's gonna last and last. And then with the colors we have, they're gorgeous. What do you, did you sell out of that sunflower? Sorry, earlier today, yeah, I'm sorry. Mm. I know I was trying to save it for you. I know how much you love it. You know I love that sunflower. We have three flowers <laughs> okay. left. You know, so my other, I should say the dahlia is kind of like, oh man, I kind love of neck it. and neck. Look All at right. this. So mm -hmm. should we work from this way? Okay, or where, where, where are the cameras set up to talk about the different? We'll do top left first. Okay. So take, Sounds or the, top right, okay. perfect. So that one's our daisy. With daisy. the gorgeous white uh, we little love petals the there. Isn't it so pretty? Okay. And then the yellow on the inside. The laser printing make it, makes it look almost three-dimensional. Oh, Isn't that does. beautiful? Yeah, that's nice. And then take a look, the dahlia. So this is the one I'm holding to yeah. Shannon. You love this I one, I do too. love the dahlia. I, I do. It's lovable. Do you know what? Because I have the dahlia in the, the, the uber size. Right, right. The big one. <laughs> the big one. Yeah. Yeah. That's really good. I know. And then we also have, if you want to put your head in the clouds, we oh. love the beautiful. Is that guy's favorite? I think it's it his favorite. That's what I thought. <laughs> Isn't okay. it so happy? And then this is the perfect leopard. I We're, love that pattern. This which comes is a with primary that. color in my world. Ex hey, me too, girl. I, I love know, it. Right? And this is coming with a color matching case. They yep. all come with black except for the solids and that leopard. Gotcha. Just so you know. Okay. And then we have classic black. I would recommend yeah. grabbing one for the gift closet. Yeah. Oh, for sure. For mm -hmm. sure. For sure. I like that. That's actually one of my favorite tones of pink. Right. It's so beautiful. Yeah. This is a new reimagined, super beautiful pink. And then we also have that gorgeous classic blue as well. Nice. So any that you might want to give as gifts, any that you might want to yep. use yourself. And you need to spread them out. You need one in your car, you, one at home. You do indeed. And uh, uh, Lori is going to show you arguably in the large or the compact design, everyone's favorite feature hands down. But this really created a revolution. It was such a phenomenon here at HSN. Viewers like me and you and Colleen, who I've lost count of how many of the better umbrellas she has purchased, demanded that we really, or they, I should say, engineer one in really more of a compact format. Because while I love the, the, the larger or the original design, to be perfectly fair, you know, I can't put it in my purse, so there were sometimes I would leave it behind. I've actually left better umbrellas at the, the gym and at the grocery store, not intentionally, of course, just because it didn't fit in my, my handbag. There are over 650,000 different incarnations of our better umbrella here at HSN. And for sun safety alone, I wish I had this size. I do not, I have the original. And this is what I need because I am very fair. Now again, you can see that great uh, control. The big thing for me is, Yes, rain, snow, sleet, or sun. So remember, you can also use this to protect yourself from the elements, you know, whether it's that bright sun or, you know, those of us out there who just feel like they're gonna turn to dust <laughs> in the light of day, of which I am one. But Lori is gonna show off, actually, I th Lori, would you say this is everybody's favorite feature? I, I, I mean, I, I think so, because this is where it really makes sense. This is that epiphany moment. We all know with a traditional umbrella, when you're getting in and out of your car, you might as well not have one at all because you get drenched, right? There's a better way with a better umbrella that reverse close technology makes all the difference. So although this is a compact umbrella, this is a giant 46 inch canopy. So as I'm opening my vehicle door, it's completely and totally covered as I lower myself down inside. So very, very easy. Then with the of that one button, all you do is you pull your better umbrella in and you only need just a little tiny space to be able to do it. So you saw as soon as I pull the umbrella in, I close the door. So the great thing about that is you're not dragging all of that water in with you. You can easily stay so much drier with the better umbrella. So it's a better design. And then we've all done this too, right? You've sat in your car for a while waiting for the rain to subside on a rainy day because you don't want to get wet. Well, all you do is barely open your door, touch one button of that automatic 
quick, easy open mechanism. And again, you are instantly and immediately protected. So you're not gonna let the rain hold you down any longer. This is dual ply construction, no exposed metal here. You have double metal ribbing, but Shannon, it's been sandwiched in between those two plies. And with that brand new hydrophobic fabrication, the water just rolls right off. It's like that rain product you put on your windshield, but it's been infused into this fabric. So it's a better umbrella, even better than our original better umbrella. So there are so many upgrades that we've only scratched the surface, whether it's the light or the compact design or that reinforced material. Now, here's what I think is so funny about this. Lori and I, see now I do it sans kids, you do it with little London, London, you know. Yes, yes. We love the place with the ears. Yes. But in the world, it, there's one part of that world where there's no shade whatsoever. And right. I have broken down, I bought the little paper parasol, you know the one that I'm talking about? You need something at that park, uh, at those parks. It's a yes, lot more than $19. I'll just tell you that right yes. now. A lot more than $19. And not really reusable. Uh, the paper no, ones get exactly. damaged. Yep. And for me, as I said earlier, sometimes it's not just the rain as much as it is trying to shield myself from the sun. Absolutely. And All elements. Now, what's interesting is we say that this is quote unquote a more compact design, but... Look at this. So I'm going to get all romantical. Look at this. I love it. So I carry my son, like you said. Yep, exactly. You can have your groceries. Yeah. You can have a giant handbag. Everything yep. can be shielded and protected. For sure. So we love that. Now, you know what's so funny? When I backed away, did you see what I did? I... And it's probably because I haven't had anybody underneath my me with my better umbrella. I was looking for the wire, you know, for the metal. Right, right. And I thought, oh, because I, I was doing this. I'm like, oh, I got to get the, the metal over Lori's hair because I don't want to, you We're know. We're so cautious of that, right? I, I really, because have you ever caught your hair in, I Ow. have. I have two. Where I've had to like, cut. I mean, seriously, you want to talk about YouTube. I'm traumatized. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> but you right? know what makes me mad? I bet you that was easily as much as you're spending here. That's the whole thing. I These bet. little compact umbrellas yeah. are typically really expensive. They're about $20. Oh, yeah. So they about are. what you're paying for your better umbrella. This is single ply construction. This isn't wind resistant at all. I think this is going to touch even the lightest oh, breeze and it's going to tulip out the other direction. With better umbrella, it's wind resistant to yeah. 38 miles per hour. There's all that exposed metal. I look at that and it makes my head hurt because uh, I know it's going to pull my hair, does. right? I know. So this is a poor design. Yep. The other poorly designed umbrella is this guy. So we've been carrying this guy around for a long time as well. Yep. And the problem with it is you go to close it. First of all, you have to muscle through it, right? Yep. But look at this. It's closing down in a way that all the water is just dripping yep. all over me. It's getting me wet, my outfit it wet, is. ruining my hairstyle. Oh, yeah. This makes no sense. No, nope. this is why we love the better umbrella. Uh, and, and you know what? That's not going in your purse. And here's the other thing. <laughs> True. <laughs> What's so fun, because uh, the arthritis in my hands has gotten so bad, I actually was having problems like unloading the dishwasher the other night. So for me, I can hit one button. One button. Okay. Easy. And then it's, it's I'm not applying, I'm just pushing. So it's so not easy. like I have to, you know, have a lot of dexterity, you know, if that's a, a problem. And there's that light. Right, there's exactly. That light. Flashlight built right in, multi-directional. Yep. It's also preloaded with batteries. There yep. is your beautiful daisy. daisy. So I love that one with daisy the petals cute. and that beautiful yellow in the center. It yeah. feels like you could reach up and touch it. Like it has that almost texture no, to you're it. Right. Then we have the Dahlia. This that's is one my of my other favorite. personal favorites too. Because so the pink pretty. and then how vibrant it is. It's just this really warm glow coming yeah. from the center Looks and the good. yellow. Yep. We have the beautiful blue sky with puffy white clouds. That just makes, makes me happy. Me smile, me doesn't too. it? I know, right? Me too. It's great. And then for all of our animal lovers out there, the fashionista. Yes, you know it. The Shannons mm -hmm. for the Shannons mm -hmm. in your life. You, know you gotta I like get my the leopard. <laughs> I gotta get the leopard print. Yep. That one is adorable. It even comes with that color matching case. Isn't so this cool? is a total perfect match. Back to that better umbrella. Look how nice. cute that is. If I can get it in here. Very Hello. cute. There it is. Adorable. Then we also have for you your classic. Black. Yep. I would say get an extra at this oh, price for your at gift closet. Yeah, least. maybe grab a black one or just a solid color oh, that you could sure. give because it's so practical. It yeah. will get used. And I'll tell you, if you don't order enough, your friends will steal them. This oh, has happened to me repeatedly. Will. Oh, absolutely. Right? <laughs> and then, of course, I love that tonality of that pink. Is, Isn't that pretty? It's so nice. It's a vibrant pink. It really oh, has sure. a lot of punch to it. Yeah. And then the perfect medium blue. So for the guys out there, anyone who loves the color blue, just a very gender friendly choice. Yes. Oh, for sure. Sure. So uh, we're we're all going inside we're now. We're going inside, girl. We we're all the, going inside. We got the better totes next <laughs> from the better umbrella folks. Do you know what? Is I that the most amazing that the thing? The other day, Did you? I have got it. I think it was maybe one of your first errands. Yes, I'm so right. excited about that doggone toad. So okay. good, right? All right. So there's the light, and we are going inside. We've got the toad. We've got the lights with Lou. Uh, 
And you know, at the end of my night, I will need a drink. So that's what Kelly Dietering is going to help me out with, with our wine opener. So in just a few moments, Lori's going to help give you all the details on this fabulous uh, tote set. Whether your grocery store, like mine, is, is charging you, well, actually not even charging you, they don't, they don't have bags. And it's, I freaked me out. Well, this is more than just transportable. If you live 45 minutes away from the grocery store like my parents, guess what? What's that ice cream got to do but melt? You know, whether it's the popsicles or the ice cream or the cold sodas, uh, food safety is king, especially this time of year. Well, I'm going to the great indoors. <laughs> Let's see what happens next. Stay tuned. <laughs> Have you signed up for HSN email? Sign up for HSN emails now to stay connected on our hottest and newest deals of the week. And you'll even receive exclusive coupons and never miss a today's special. We'll send you the scoop on our best value of the day straight to your inbox. So head on over to hsn.com now and search email to sign up today. It's party time. HSN is turning 41 and you're invited to join the fun. Discover surprises you'll love. Savings to celebrate. Exclusive finds and all new favorites. We're even giving away a trip a day. So come join the fun all month long. It's our birthday, your party on HSN and HSN.com. Don't miss a thing with our HSN app, available on Apple and Android devices. Get $10 off your first in-app purchase with code WELCOME10. Opt in to push notifications for early access to exclusive app-only deals. Shop faster than ever with exclusive new product videos, only on the iPhone. Watch HSN Live anytime, anyplace. And the new shop and search features make finding your favorites easier than ever. Search app on hsn.com to download. It's our birthday. Apply for the HSN credit card and party like a VIP. Instantly get $25 off when you're approved. Plus enjoy extra flex on jewelry, beauty, and fashion purchases all day, every day. And the gifts keep on coming. You'll get VIP financing, VIP easy returns, exclusive offers, and no annual fee. Apply now and celebrate like never before. Call 1-800-695-1418 or search HSN card at hsn.com. I'm spending money with Lori Leland. You didn't even, were your ears burning when I was shopping with you? Oh, by the way, as seen totally. on TV. <laughs> Sorry, let me do the business. I'm taking care of personal we're stuff so here. We're so busy shopping. Don't mind me. No kidding, it must have been the first airing of these. Yes, and right. I, I'm surprised you couldn't hear me squealing like a little school girl right. from these home. These are awesome. This is so perfect because a, if your grocery store does not have bags, right. that's number one. Or B, oh yeah, right. This horrible mess. You feel guilty using oh, these, don't and they get, always break. Don't even get me started. Not or, reusable. Or B, whether it's the beach or the ballpark or the picnic shelter. Mm -hmm. You know, my mom and dad live 45 minutes. What? Well, actually, closer to an hour, depending on which store they're going to, because you know they're a farm family. Sure. And I'm telling you, they by the time mom gets home, because. Pat is not so great with time management. Uh, I could pretty much trust you. The ice cream is no longer ice cream. You know, it's an ice cream smoothie. So you get, you choose your color and choice. Now right. you get four. So this is, that's the one I got, the multicolor, right? Right, okay. right, this is it. So beautiful pinks, you've got the two pink, the light pink, the brighter pink, the teal, and the gray. Okay. The then, come in that one, okay, yeah. Then the center, and I'll just show you this real quick, and then I'm gonna do some work on my bangs. <laughs> just a no second. worries. Just a little second. Uh, so, and this one is, which one is this, Lori? So that Multi one's your pattern. Oh, pattern, yeah. okay. And then Ugh. this is your basics. And your basics. Yep, exactly. So your basics has the blue, the black, the red, the green. Oh, that's a pretty green, a I like that. beautiful green, love the basics. These sort of match some of the Better Brella. Oh, they so, do. So because this is from oh, the right, manufacturer you're right, you're right. of the Better Brella, that's gonna yes. match some of your prints. Okay, and then I, I was telling Lori, I don't know what it is with me in pink lately, but the multicolor, I would say that's two different pinks. When you like kind of a like a uh, a nice you know bright pink, fuchsia pink, and then like a teal and a a gray. All right, I am going to turn you loose okay, for a girl. moment while I be, <laughs> I'm going to unpack some bags. While I be utify myself. <laughs> 
<laughs> so no don't problem. mind me. <laughs> Which won't take long at there all. You go. Sure, it'll look beautiful. So here's what we love about this. This is lightly insulated on the inside. You get the pack of four. These are beautifully made with that zipper top. Um, you have a giant front pocket, which is so handy for your keys, your sunscreen, great for the beach, perfect for overnight trips. If you are going to make a stop after the grocery store, or like Shannon was saying with her parents, you have a long commute from the grocery store. You want to keep things cool. You can even throw these freezer packs in. So if you have these, I know I have them for my son's lunch. That will keep things colder longer. But look at all the produce that came out of one bag. This is going to hold so much stuff and it's leak proof. So if you're throwing a roaster in here or if you want to pack ice and throw sodas on top, you can do that for the beach. It's perfect. So now I'm going to take out my cool thing. So there I've got my hamburgers, my hot dogs. Here I've got my eggs. We have a nice bottle of wine in here as well. Then we also have our juice. We have... Uh, some more juice we've got our, our, our milk whatever that is and then half and half so all of these things coming out of these bags and they are so easy to maneuver but look at all of the things that you can fit inside so let's do one more bag here at the grocery store so inside that we have our rice our salt we have our coffee look at all the things that fit in here we've got our salad dressing our mustard for the hot dogs and our um, burgers we've got our shredded cheese right here look at this so you're ready for the barbecue you're ready to go to the beach you're ready to go into your home from the the grocery store look at this more cans I'm just gonna keep stacking them up here because I'm running out of table space but look at the capacity there we got our mac and cheese and our pasta so the capacity that we have in each bag is truly incredible and yes. I want to show you leak proof technology here so you have that light insulation on the inside you can see that all right look in here I want you to see what's okay. inside Oh, yeah, water. Water. So we poured this in at 8 a.m. Oh, for our morning show. Yeah, and yeah, none yeah. of the water has leaked out. So I just want to show you. We're going to go to town here with two more bottles. So I'm just going to keep filling it. Do you know how happy it. this makes me? It's amazing. I Throw mean, ice in here and you can put drinks you know on so top. interesting? This was actually the only thing I was worried about. I must have missed that during the presentation I watched the Look. other day. Because I thought, oh, well, if they're this lightweight, they... Might it's holding the water and not oh, one drop, man. even like 12 hours later. I'm impressed. So leak I'm proof impressed. technology. Yeah. And look how tiny they fold. Pat, so which color do you want? <laughs> I know she's already saying, oh, oh, I need that when I go to the Walmart because, you know, that ice cream melts. <laughs> right. So text me. Pat texts now, which is a little oh frightening. Oh, my gosh. I love uh, it. She's, text me which color you want, Mom. And She's you know, on it. You know, That's amazing. She's on it. $19.95. I am so in love with this. And it's not only because I'm a... Lori knows I love to cook. So it is yes. not super chef. It over is here. not unlikely that I'll go to three different grocery stores, you know, in right. one night, you know, from store to store to store. And not only do I usually end up with the bags that break. Yes. Okay. Which they let you down. Oh, You're chasing your groceries. Man, that, that makes me mad. Not reusable. Don't you feel guilty? Oh, yes. You feel guilty using them. Some I know. Ch uh, stores charge uh, you for course. those. And I'll be perfectly honest with you. There was a situation and I won't say the grocery store, but by the time I got home and there was traffic and I went, they were, you know, I ran out of one thing. Right. It was Chilean sea bass. Do you know how much that is? Oh my gosh. That's twenty-five dollars a fillet. Oh well, my this goodness. Was, because it was a big chunk, I I couldn't use it because oh. it was too. I could tell. I I, I didn't want to risk it. It was too You've warm too to the long. touch. Oh no, that's not yeah. good. Yeah. And boy, I'll tell you, you don't have to live in Florida where even if you just leave them in the trunk or the hatchback of right. your car for what you would think wasn't a long period of time. It's dangerous. Uh, it's, it's dangerous. It can be, yeah. Yes, so it that's is. that's really something you have to worry oh, about. Yeah. You want to protect your food costs. Of course you do. All right, so 35 cans fit in here. 35. Oh, is that crazy? My word. And then think about this, too. If you want to pack a lunch, but you want to keep yeah. everything cool until you get there. So I've got my better umbrella, my banana. Yeah. I have some tissues in here because I always have a runny nose. I have no idea what I'm Me allergic too. to, but I suspect it's everything. <laughs> Soda. There we've got our cutlery right there. And then we also have, look at these giant trays. This whole for your so lunch. Much. So this holds two of these. It could hold five. That's how many you could stack oh, yeah. up high. Look at how giant yeah. these are. But here's the thing. Like, as an example, I brought in sushi for one of our makeup artists Ice tonight. Cream. And yeah. I don't care what that container is packed in. It right. leaks a little bit. Oh, my gosh. Those and, are always leaking. Yes. So even if this leaks, you, 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 you know, especially the sauces, you can wipe that out. And girl... I didn't even think of this until I saw how it folds down. Right. Airport, 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 Perfect. airport. Because you know how I always buy my food and then bring it on the airplane, like right. a lot of us do? And boy, nothing makes me angry. I'm a weird about food temperature. Oh, I am too, Then girl. if something has either gotten Beach. too warm or too cold. So this goes in your carry-on, and then you buy the lunch. Because I'll let you carry on your little lunch exactly. that you bought. Exactly. And Love it'll keep it. it nice and cool. So ice cream party at school. You got yeah. two gallons in here, four half gallons, the whipped cream, the bowls, the cutlery. Mm -hmm. 
nice. that huge pocket at the front. So this is our beach bag. I had the volleyball in there. Too Look, cute. I brought my wallet and this giant deep pocket Boy, that you have in the front. A lot, Sunscreen. I've got my car keys in here. You can put your cell phone in. Yeah. I've got my deodorant because after the beach, you're going to be needing that, right. right? And then think about this too for your emergency preparedness. So this oh, has a beautiful sure. silky texture on the outside. You could just wipe this down to keep yep. it clean. But I love the bright color. You can see it. You can find mm, it. Good keep it point. zipped closed. But look, this has your emergency water. Yeah. This has your emergency blanket. This has your wife's foods. It's got yeah. your flashlights. It your does. extra batteries are in the front pocket. So everything that you need, I know. your Nighthawk pen, everything here for sure. is, can be but you know, sorted easily. Me, you know, I've got, I'm on all this crazy arthritis medication right now. And th they haven't told me, oh, it should be refrigerated. But I always feel better if it's like in a cooler sure. bag, you know, especially if I'm going from place to place to say nothing of it. I certainly wouldn't put an ice pack in here when I do this, but even my electronics. Yes, you know, true. You, you don't know, want things to get too hot. Because you don't, Shannon, exactly. you want to do a picnic with me? Wine Hello. and cheese? I'm inviting myself. Uh, come on. No, I'm just inviting I, I'm, you. I'm inviting, yes. Cheese board. I'm here going. we've got our grapes. Look, we've got our tablecloth. Everything fits inside. You love these bags. They're so awesome. Uh, I love them. You know what? I'm, well, Mom, tell me which color you want. I'll send them. <laughs> I'm actually thinking about getting another another set just because you know gym ballpark beach certainly this is the time of year but any time of year yes I thank love you so you. much i love you shannon thank you girly i'm glad you got these i'm I so know. excited i can't wait to hear how I you know. use them I, I, I use mine for everything i'll probably post pictures on facebook mom. i know yes, right everything okay all right so you'll see Lori again uh very soon i'm sure uh i am actually i like this i can get a few more steps in so Lou is gonna help me out. I'm gonna transition to our last item of the hour. Lou? Shannon? What are you doing? <laughs> well, we've got something brand new. This is actually really exciting. It's a brand new product that we just introduced today. It's called the Nighthawk, and it's a security light that you can use indoors or outdoors. It works off of batteries, so there's no wiring required. You can mount it on anything that you want, any place you want. And these are some super bright LEDs that are inside of this. In fact, this little light puts out 450 lumens of power. That's a lot of power. Now, I'll give you a quick overview on the light itself. So you're going to get two, two of these when you buy them, okay? And this is what they look like right here. This is what the light itself looks like. And you can see right here, there's two LEDs. Oh, my friend Shannon's coming in. There's well, two I LEDs. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> and have. And have. I did. Mm. <laughs> Former rodeo. That's right. You know? That's right. Uh, I have to say, Lou, and I'm so sorry. I was getting my steps in. So no, you're I fine. Thank you for the help. Where did this price, this is a really good price. Isn't it a great price? Oh man. Yeah, and I'm, I'm telling you, what's amazing about these is the technology that's in them. Right here, so if you look right here, okay? Yeah. Looks like headlights, right? It there does. are two SMD LEDs in there. It stands for surface mount device LEDs. Super, super bright LEDs, okay? okay. 450 lumens of power comes Ooh. out of these. Tremendous. You're not messing this around. part right here, that is a photo cell and a motion sensor. So what this light does is during the daytime, it's not gonna come on, right, okay? Right, right. Soon yep. as it gets dark, the photo cell tells the motion sensor activate. So now the motion sensor, when it senses something moving around, the lights are gonna come on super bright yeah. and they will stay on for 20 seconds or until okay. the motion oh, stops. Like, <laughs> see, you can, you can give a girl a heads up. You weren't so, expecting that, yeah, were you? No, so not only did they come on automatically, that is bright. Isn't it crazy, right? Uh, let me just tell you, I have to back away, you know, so I don't burn out. Don't my be scared. Breath. Come yeah, in here. Okay, okay. Come in here. It's let everybody bright. see you. I could do like little shadow puppets. Isn't it amazing? <laughs> well, and here's the thing. So we've got Ooh. we've got a couple of them out here on the set. Watch this. If I point this at the camera, do you see how bright that is? Yeah. It's it's like a blinding light. If I put it on myself. <gasps> It's like having a spotlight. I still wasn't prepared These for are it. crazy, okay? And if I watch this, if I point it toward the back wall, look at this. It's actually yeah. illuminating the entire wall from ceiling to floor. And our ceilings are crazy, crazy you know tall what, here. Though? I'm sure people use that. that for that, for that purpose oh, sure. as well though, right? Yeah, no, they do. They use them for all sorts of things. I mean, yeah. you can use this as a spotlight, but as a security light, you can mount this on anything you want, yeah. above your front door, above your garage doors, yeah. on railings for steps. You can mount, I actually mounted one, and I kid you not, yesterday, I mounted one on a tree in my front yard. Oh, did you really? On a tree, because I have a circular driveway, and I wanted the light uh, to come on whenever I come home. Now, yeah. here's what's interesting. Okay. This takes four D-sized batteries, oh. okay? Just conventional D-sized batteries. Okay. You will get 3,000 illuminations out of this, no meaning 3,000 times this light will come on. Now. If you have somebody running around in front of the kids or playing, you know, wiffle ball in front of it all night long, eh, it may not last the 3,000 times, but 
under normal usage right. 3000. Now I'm gonna walk over here to the doorway because I want you to see something. This is this is security right here. Watch this, you can't see me, can't see me, can't see me. And then I step in the doorway. And now all of a sudden you can see me. You can see exactly where I am. If somebody were inside, they could look out a window. Yeah, they, they could see me coming up here. Let's go over to the staircase and that's on the other side of the set. So I'm just gonna walk right past Shannon again. Hi, how are you doing? Bye Lou. Here, I'm gonna take my spotlight Bye. with me. So come on over here though. Now notice this one's not on. As soon as I walk over here, it came on and look at the staircase. Yeah, talk about you can see everything on the stairs right here. And again, oh, that's 450 lumens of yeah. light. And for folks who don't know, TV cameras suck up light. They take uh -huh. a tremendous you amount they do. of light they do. For, to, to produce an image. But you know, I'm looking at that stairwell. It, yeah. It's actually a pretty good representation of my brother's uh, uh, back patio area sure. or that deck. And I'll tell you, that is dark, because I live on a farm, right. you know, so there's no illumination. And so they throw like the kitchen light on, but you can't see to go down the stairs. No. And boy, when the dog needs to go out, it scares you. You're like, and inevitably, I'm almost always missing a step. Oh, yeah. But it's not practical to do hard white, you know, no. wiring. Well, no, and it's expensive to do that. Let me yeah. show you this for a second here, because well, what a lot of people try to do is they say, all right, I'm going to put up some security lights sure. outside. So when we think security lights, what do we do? Well, we think of uh, something like, big money. like this when I'm holding <laughs> my hands right here, okay? Yeah. Uh, and these security lights, when you look at these guys, it, you know, it has a motion sensor. You know, you've got two pretty bright yeah. bulbs on there. Yeah. Here's the problem, all this wiring on the back. So unless you're, you're gonna mount it someplace yeah. where there's actually already um, you know, some hot wires, yeah. you gotta hire an electrician to come I, out and I run that. I was just gonna say, I'm sure not doing that on my own. Um, I couldn't mount this to the tree that I did yesterday, okay? Because okay. there is no power at the tree. No. But yeah. I don't need to worry about that. Now, a couple more things about this. If you, this is one of the ingenious things they did about this. When you mount this, okay, we give you all the mounting hardware right. that you need with it. We give you mollies and screws so you can mount it on anything you need to. When you mount this to the base, right, okay? Yeah. First First of all, this is adjustable, so you can aim the light well, even after handy. it's mounted, yeah. okay? And you can do it that way or you can adjust it this way and tilt it up and down so you can get that light exactly where you need it. If you have to ever change the batteries, you don't have to take the whole thing down. Right. The front of this just screws off and comes off and there's a battery compartment right there. These are rated IP65 for dust and water. So you can oh, leave these outside yeah. all year round. You don't need to worry about the elements. This locks right back on there and you're good to go. Yeah. Remember, 3,000 illuminations. Now, I know what you're thinking. I live up north. There's lots of snow. That is exactly. Did you see the it's wheels raining. turning? It rains. I mean, Let me see if I can get this guy to come on. There we go. Okay. Thinking. Watch this. I just got this one to go on by tricking it, by covering the motion sensor. Yeah. But watch this. I can pour water on this guy, just so you can see. So, you know, if it's a hurricane, if there's a storm, it's almost too bright for the camera. Yeah. Do you see no, how bright right. that is? Trust me, there's water going on that right now. <laughs> In fact, wait, wait, wait. No, I'll, do, I'll do I'll do right. that. So you can see. Oh, but look at that, look yeah. at the, how the water goes on. And it went, it didn't go off because something happened, it went off because it's very, very bright in here. And the photo cell just, there we go. The photo cell tells it, don't turn on, so I gotta trick it every once in a while and put my hand over it. That is awesome. Isn't that cool though? And I mean, this is like the easiest way. Now, it is. I've been talking a lot about mounting these outside. Right. There's nothing says you can't put these inside. Well, if you've got a dark closet, if you need to light no, your right. basement, an attic, your yeah. garage, a shed, sure. inside a barn, yeah. anywhere you want. Put them in your emergency kit. Why not? For a hurricane. I mean, because I can just, you know, if I can get this guy, yeah. if I can trick this one too. Look. Yeah. Look at the power that out of this light. How bright does it? Oh, that's great. One other thing, couple things. Actually, this will light an area of 675 square feet. Oh come on! I can't believe I almost left that out. 675 <gasps> square feet of light coming off of this. That's 450 so small lumens. It really is. I mean, my seriously. first apartment was actually a little smaller. Than that. <laughs> So this will light that whole area. Oh, and the motion sensor will be activated up to 36 feet away. Oh, no kidding. Yeah. So, I mean, you don't have to worry about somebody having to get right up on it. If somebody's yeah. walking up your driveway, right, right, yeah. this is coming on. Well, I, I got to tell you, I'm impressed, especially for that price. I know I keep going back to that, but, I mean, it, it looks like that professional, you know, hardwired lighting. It really does. It does. That's actually what it reminds me of. But come on, for 19 bucks, the safety, the security, the peace of mind. Yeah. Even, even it's just something as simple as letting the dogs out. Yeah, I mean, in the seriously. backyard. Yeah. I mean, for me, you know what? It's funny you say that too, because I used to have a solar light in my backyard yeah. that I would use for the exact same thing, just because sure. I let the dog out. I just wanted to come on, and when she came in. Yeah. The nice thing about this, though, is it doesn't stay on. So yes, after 20 seconds, see, like point. this guy here turned itself off, but yeah. if I move my hand in front of it here, 
see how it comes back on again. And it'll stay, and actually, it's so bright, it almost looks like headlights. I mean, honestly, it really does. does. It's crazy, crazy bright. Remember a couple of years ago, to get this much light, how many LEDs would you need? Uh, we have two. I know. That's all that's in these are two. That's crazy. Isn't that amazing? Well, and you know, great gift giving idea. I yeah. mean, I, I'm even thinking for my brother on the fish house, because normally they're trying to point the headlights from the truck, you know. Yes. To, you know, to see the door. And oh, then, this would be perfect. I mean, and, you know, it can be kind of dangerous because it's at night and yeah. there's snow and there's ice and it's slippery. The other alternative is that that hardwired contraption that Lou had. Yeah. It's either off or it's on. The this, you know, this guy like, right here. You got to call my brother and say, "Hey, can you turn the light on? I'm on my way over, so right. that you don't fall and kill yourself yeah. on the pavement getting the Christmas gifts into the house." I mean, <laughs> seriously, like, so it's either off or it's on. You know, so if, no, if somebody doesn't turn it on, and what are you going to do if you're the first one home? I mean, or the last right. one home? I mean, right. you leave that light burning and ha have that electric that electric bill going on all night long just. For that sure. one per straggler who's yeah. coming home late. Well, I'm going to walk over the door one time just so you okay. can see that. I mean, look at this. Look at the light that comes off of this guy over here. This one's been on the entire time. Nice. And that's the thing. As long as Shannon and I are moving around over yep. there, they're going to stay on. Now, you notice the ones on the front of the table keep shutting off. Why? Because right. there's nothing moving in yeah. front of them. Okay? There's nothing happening in front of them. Yeah. Now, I'm going to walk over to the staircase again. And this is fun. Watch this. I'm going to walk over here. And as okay. I walk over to the staircase, the one on the staircase isn't on until I get close to it. And now it came on. Nice. And you can see there's that light going yeah. all the way down there. You For know, and sure. if you wanted to use them inside, oh, absolutely. if you have some, maybe a that. company staying over and they're not familiar yeah. with the layout of your house, there's For no sure. reason that you couldn't just put one of these, I know. you know, on a tabletop oh, or whatever. Absolutely. And especially because I, I do use those little, you know, indoor, you know, lights, but they don't cast a lot of light. They don't. So it, they're not necessarily a lot of help for me. You know what I mean? It's like, okay, I can see there's a light on, but I can't necessarily see where yeah. I'm still walking or where I That's way go. more than a nightlight. <laughs> That's I'm just, way... gonna, I'm just gonna tell you right now. <laughs> but see, for me, I love this because I'm one of those people that I want to mount it to a tree. Yeah. I want to put yeah. it on my dock. I want to be able to put it on a fence post or, for you know, sure. wherever I want to yeah, put it. Absolutely. Lou, thank you. You're welcome. I appreciate the help as My always. Pleasure. I love this. I'm actually thinking about getting these uh, for the great indoors. These are I mean, very seriously. cool. Seriously. All right. Well, as it should be, I get to end my show with cocktails or with wine. I'm in. I know. I'm in. <laughs> All right. But let's see what Brett has coming up at midnight. Hey, Brett. So I heard cocktails. Where? They're not happening in this studio. I came to the wrong place. Okay, well, we've got the music playing and we're ready to go. So it's about to be the 4th of July. As my friend Bill Duggan reminded me, I'm wearing my annual 4th of July shirt. Pull this out once a year exclusively for you guys here at HSN. And what we've got for you tonight for our biggest and best value of the day on the 4th of July, best value ever on truly wireless earbuds, a brand new model at a ear popping price. Now, this is the way that you get 12 hours of truly wireless playback, a totally awesome universal gift for Apple users and Android users, for tablets, for cell phones, for smart TVs. We've got exclusive colors you can't find anywhere here, uh, anywhere but here at HSN, and we have the lowest price absolutely anywhere in America for upgraded top of the line truly wireless earbuds that aren't going anywhere. They actually stay in comfortably. They'll be on in 13 minutes. I'm gonna hop over for a drink with Shannon. See you soon. I wanna know, annual 4th of July shirt, what about the undergarments? <laughs> Something to ponder at midnight. I'm just saying. Can you tell that I'm getting warmed up for the item that Gilly has? Here's what's so funny. I have, I, I've seen, Ke first of all, Kelly, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Yeah, I'm fantastic. You see Kelly with some wonderful items, uh, especially around our kitchen. I have watched you on the air with this, <laughs> like, pop. Probably a dozen times. Yep. So let's just start with what is obvious to me because I've loved you from afar. <laughs> what is this? Why this, is it different? Okay, this this is this is how it's different. There you go, my friend. Okay. Open that bottle oh, of wine for yeah, me. Yeah, see? <laughs> I already told her I haven't slept today. It's so. the best way to open your wine. You will never oh need double A batteries, triple A batteries. You will never need CO2 cartridges. This is bottle rocket, and it opens wine by okay. using a couple of pumps of oh. air. Oh my lord. All right, Shannon, how you doing okay, over there? Do you know what? I, I, this is God's honest truth. <laughs> it the hurts. Do you know my arthritis, arthritis is so bad? I couldn't unload the dishwasher.
dishwasher last yeah. night. Oh, I told boy. my mom this story. So listen, <laughs> at the risk of using adult language, <laughs> yes, let's I'm gonna it, have to we'll keep it clean tonight until Thank we start you. drinking the wine. No, this is so wild. So even with my arthritis, it looks like the you pressure do it. of it's the, the air. Pressure of the air actually pops it right. out. I'll go slow and then we'll talk about okay. everything because we're getting. See, unlike this yes. or the little screw thing, you don't have to have Twist. like or any like, strength. Like, a finger no, hand string. No string. So you just yeah. pierce it. There's a little pier, uh, pin. You pierce okay. it all the way down to the cork. Gotcha. And then you grab at the bottle level right down here. Okay. Yeah. I don't want you to grab up here because that, it won't work. Okay. Right. So always grab it out of the bottle, bottle level. And then you just take your dominant hand and you start pumping. But see, and I can do that you even can with pump. my, my arthritis. <gasps> Oh, that's a Christmas it miracle. Is, it is actually a great Christmas gift. It, it and is. I don't know if we Absolutely. will have the metal I know. around Christmas time, but I know. you're not just getting the bottle rocket. Right. So let's talk about everything that you're getting. Okay, sounds good. You're getting the foil cutter, and these are all brand new birthday colors, and the met I metal is say, birthday. I love Aren't they gorgeous? Are, are we calling that rose gold or copper? Uh, rose gold. <gasps> oh. Yes. Black, yes. gold, uh, silver, silver, or rose gold. Okay. Foil cutter, yeah. the bottle top aerator, which is worth 50 which or 60 to tell you. It's right I, there. I, I, do you know what? I, I learned today from you when you were on with yeah. Bobby. I haven't slept today, so I've seen you all hours My a day. Girl. I think I think it's how, because I wasn't airweighted. Airweighted you're getting, wine, you're getting the, Are you getting the red wine that, headache? That's why I was getting a red wine headache. Yeah, it's very true. So you're getting the bottle top aerator, you're getting the vacuum sealer, and you're getting the pouch that you see it contained in. Yep. It's so much fun to keep for yourself, but it's such a great gift. These are all brand new colors. They, they are. Hey, by the way, actually, Steve, which is the most, I'm guessing that rose gold will probably be the first one to go. It is uh, it is less than $6 on your credit card. Let me just put this in a couple of different perspectives because many of you know I am a foodie. I have purchased aerators, yes. aerators yep. for more than $29.95. Yep. I have purchased, they used to have, I won't say, I think it's probably a brand name, like a little cork poppy thing. Yes. You know the one yes, I'm talking the about? The CO2 cartridge you want? Yep. Yes, where you have to purchase and, the, re you, repurchase and the CO2 cartridge. Do you know what? I, I have to find, in fact, I have one on my mom and dad's farm. It doesn't work because I can't find the little cartridges anymore. Yes. And you have to really do a specialty search. Yep. I can tell you those little cartridges are going to cost you more than a flex pay. Yep. And then usually with aerators, uh, if you're familiar like the big decanter, yep. there's big, also... funky, oh, expensive. Do you know the really expensive one that I'm talking about that they... Probably. Yeah, starts with yes, a B. Yes. 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 <laughs> I that, own one of those. Yes. Yeah, I know. That's a lot more than $29, yes. folks. It's resealing, vacuum sealing. So yep. you, let's talk about all the pieces can that you're you, getting. Can you tell them how you did that again? Yes, okay. all you do is pump. You just oh, pump the air just, out. Oh, yeah, yes, yeah. yeah. So here's actually a really good video of everything you're getting. Okay. The foil cutter. Everybody knows how to use one, but this right. is a really nice one, and it matches the set. So yeah. you're getting the foil cutter. The bottle rocket wine opener to me is just the it's genius. It's genius. So genius. you just pump a little bit of air, and it pops the cork out right. in seconds. No CO2 cartridges to purchase. No batteries. Now the aerator, as Shanna pointed out, there are aerators that are sixty dollars. <laughs> this is a triple oh, wow. chamber aerator, and it's bottle top, which means. It hits really? the chamber three times and aerates your wine. Oh, it this is. This is the vacuum stopper you were just asking me about. Oh. All you do is take a couple of pumps. Well, it depends on how much wine is removed from the bottle, but it's usually a couple of pumps, and it's removing the um, the air. So if you have an expensive bottle of wine, yeah. you can preserve it. You can. Or if you have, like, a wine fridge and you need to store on your side, For it sure. recorks it. And, you know, a little tip of the trade, and you probably already know this, if you're whether you're a connoisseur or not, it can make a $10 wine oh, yeah. taste far more elevated yep. when... When you, when you aerate I it. I say it'll take a $10 a bottle of wine and make it taste like a $50 yeah. bottle. It Seriously. really does. So uh, almost 70,000 wow. of you have selected this. Uh, gift giving gift. I love the new colors. I am getting that rose gold. I have one They're of the gorgeous. Uh, but I'm going to play devil's advocate here for a moment. Yes. So any other, like the other system, that little cartridge thing oh. that I was talking about, can, can this, is there ever near any hidden costs? Are there other things that I have to For buy? For the CO2 cartridges. Right. Yes, you always have to refill them with the same brand. Right. 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 Or if you own an electric opener, which yes. many of us do, and maybe which you're I thinking. Which I also had and was not a good. Batteries, they yep. also, they the, the batteries typically uh, go dead halfway through opening a bottle. They do. Right. It's ah. stuck. <laughs> and so that's never going to happen. Ah. That's the sound. You know it well, girl. So right up here we remind you not to. To grab and the and the work the stop. Grab at the bottle level, and all it takes is a couple of pumps, and you're good to go. So you can and you can actually sort of feel yeah. the cork popping out. So I'll show you on this one, and I'll go slow. Okay. okay. So you have that little pin, yep. and all you do is pierce 
the cork, Just right? Make sure it goes through. And you only want to pierce it once because gotcha. when once you pierce it, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. it's gonna Perfect. yeah, that's yep. what it pops the air out. Couple of pumps, you can see. And when I go from slow, the whole bottle. from the bottle, I was trying okay. to go slow there, and it literally infuses enough air. And then this little ring, I like because all I do is press that ring, and my cork is given back to me undamaged. Yeah. Have you ever poured a glass of wine and there's been little bits oh, of cork? More it's times. It's so embarrassing. Uh, I'm telling it's you. It's a terrible hostess situation when you have to get the spoon to get the cork bits out Absolutely. of somebody's wine. And and, and especially, because like I said, I've had some real arthritis flare-ups. The, the, a lot of these wines are doing, is it like a wax sealing? Yes, have you a sealing. That? Yes. And then boy, oh boy, if you've got a traditional method of opening that wine, there was one night where, and it was an expensive bottle of wine. I'm not even kidding. I took the butter knife and I'm slamming yeah. it. I, and then I'm it's like, I don't, I don't even care yeah, anymore because I was so mad yeah. and irritated at that point. <laughs> and you know, the thing is, whether it's an inexpensive, a mod, it doesn't matter what the wine costs. Yeah, to true. me, this is about the experience, about your sanity, you know, about preserving it down to the last drop or making it taste better for that matter as well. It's also great if you are thinking housewarming. And because for me, I don't know off the top of my head if, if somebody likes red, yep. if they like white, yep. I just, you, you don't know. Yeah, in and cases. it's instead of a bottle of wine, yeah. how about a bottle rocket? Yeah. Because it comes included with that beautiful satchel. That is so cool. And show them how to open it, because yeah. no, most people haven't seen this technology, or just yes. direct them no, to the video. You're right, you're right. And that's why I go fast a couple times, slow a couple times, because once you do it once or twice, you'll just pop them like you're me, yeah, you know. And you're for sure. And then you're getting the aerator. Now I own the expensive one that Shannon <laughs> was referring to because it was a gift, but I never I in my life, well, this dreams would have paid under, over hundred dollars for that because it's a big clunky bar it top. It is. One. You bet it is. This is a bottle top aerator. If there's anybody in your life, whether it's you, whether it's your spouse, whether it's you know somebody that you know that gets the red wine headache, it's probably probably because they're not releasing the tannins, yes, right? Yes, exactly. You actually have to aerate your wine. Not only does it release the tannins and the chemicals that give the red wine headaches, but you see the air bubbles? It's opening up the wine molecules, the flavor of the wine. That's why you see people who are wine experts yeah. swirling yes. their wine, right? Yep. Or, here's, here's one that'll blow your mind. Yeah. You're actually supposed to open a bottle of red 20 minutes before you serve it. It's true. And Nobody know, in the planet does that. No. I don't know anybody that does that. It's so funny because a lot of times, it, like, say you're at a restaurant and the sommelier, or they don't know that, and it's an expensive bottle of wine, yep. and it'll taste just kind of almost acidic because it in has a way, to open yep, because the flavors. It, because it hasn't breathed. And uh, I have to say, whether it's the presentation or the preservation Thank or you. the price, Yep. or the aeration, how much alliteration <laughs> can I put <laughs> into one dissertation? <laughs> wow, uh, this is fun. I haven't slept today, And folks. she hasn't had any wine <laughs> and that I know of, at no, least. And no, wine, <laughs> no sleep and no wine, you know? But I, 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 that, to me, and I, I say this somewhat tongue-in-cheek, is the sound of happiness. Yeah. But there is... I don't care if it's inexpensive or not. There's nobody happy if you've got cork floating. Well, it's or embarrassing. It, it is embarrassing. Especially if it's your mother-in-law. That <laughs> happened to me. Oh, did it really? A cork, mother-in-law. Oh. No, it's just oh, embarrassing. Man. Have you ever taken like the little strainer and then you, you hope people aren't looking <laughs> in the kitchen and you like put it through like the little strainer, right? To Actually, try to get the no, cork out? but it doesn't surprise oh, no, me that, I have. <laughs> that you have. No, I have. Yeah. <laughs> the girl who brings her own ice and carbonated water to restaurants is back there with the strainer like, I gotta get all this cork out. Oh, that's amazing. I mean, seriously. All right, let's go slow again. So there's that pin on the inside. It's a pierce nonstick. It. Yeah, and you just pierce it. You push it all the way till it stops. Pierce, pierce it one it. time. Yeah. This little sticker reminds you, don't grab here. It's everybody's inclination to grab yeah. there. It's natural. So I it's natural. Agree. Grab at the bottle. That's all you have to do is yeah. just grab lower. And then your dominant hand, and it's yeah. for righties or lefties. And some bottles take a little more pumping than yeah. others. But it's usually three to five or six pumps. Sure. And that just pops on out. It's actually what we're calling um, our airlift technology. Not only is it actually initially infusing air into your wine, which yeah. opens up the flavors of the wine. Say. It's popping the cork out with no batteries and no CO2 oh, cartridges. Yeah. It's such a cool technology. It and is. that's why we sold. I think 50,000 yeah. uh, of them at the holidays. 70. Oh, right. Yeah, almost I mean, 70. 70,000. Oh, that's the new silver, isn't Yeah, it? this nice. one's gorgeous. So these are birthday colors. So oh, we did these I special for the that. birthday. If you love the colors, grab them, because I don't know if they're coming uh, back I, by the holidays. Know, I don't know if they will be here for the holidays. And to me, this screams holiday. It is the ultimate gift. It is also the ultimate gift 
go to gift if yes. you know if you just don't know what to get somebody yes. it's kind of that one size Everybody fits drinks all. wine men and women alike yep. and you know what even if you are drinking sulfite free or organic i do have friends who you know drink the non-alcoholic yeah wine. sure and and actually those pop have work. a tendency to go you know bad or turn vinegary esque yep. uh you know faster than others even so you can choose the black the silver the gold or the rose gold and i know you can see it in that picture but i have to say the bonus accessories really kind of pay for the purchase this oh. this aerator i am so impressed with i don't know if they that's can see. the, oh, the wait, aerator's that's here sorry. yes you're also getting the back we should spend a little more time on oh, that yeah, vacuum sorry. sealer yeah. Exactly. yeah but you can see okay so you pop the cork out that's step yep. one well step one is cut the foil right okay pop the cork out that's There's step two aerator. here's step three so you're getting all the pieces to enjoy a beautiful glass right. of wine and then that bottle top aerator just sits nicely on the inside there yep. this is a triple chamber aerator so it's actually hitting three chambers and opening nice. up the wine yeah it's going to get rid of red wine headaches for most folks, right? Because you're aerating sure. your wine and it's going to elevate the flavor profile of it your does. wine. You can take a, you know, I'll say the word cheap. You can take a cheap bottle of wine and make it taste expensive you absolutely when you can. aerate it. So once you've done that, then I just want you to yeah. take oh, your I'm vacuum watch seal. This a little more closely. Right. I've Pop never had to on. reseal anything. So this, this is, this is education But maybe for cooking me. wines yes. for folks that have yes, cooking, cooking wines. Wine. Yes. And then you just start pumping. And when it snaps back quickly, you're done pumping. So let me give it a couple more pumps. Now you see how it snapped back really quickly? Oh, I'm yeah, done pumping. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So that's how you know you're done pumping. Huh. So the more air, wine that's removed, the longer it takes because yeah. you're removing more air. Right. But it's not only preserving your wine, it's resealing it. Yeah. So you Smart. can store it sideways or in your refrigerator, big, take it yes. home with you if you're that at a restaurant. Big. big like big, you ever big. been to a restaurant and oh. you're like, everybody hurry and drink the yes, wine. I know. Because, because you want to, well, you know, you pay for it. I know here in Florida they have the recorking laws, but they also have like kind of half off, you know, wine yep. bottles on Tuesday, et cetera. Yep. Kelly, are you here on the 4th? Um, I am here all day on the 4th. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. I <laughs> am not. Oh, lucky you. Trouble abounds. <laughs> Today's special's next. <laughs> Well, it is officially the 4th of July here at HSN, and we are celebrating in a very big way. We have taken our number one best-selling truly wireless earbud, the one that works with every cell phone, every tablet, every